This is Dunkleosteus, a large fish with a bony armored skull and one of the first apex predators 360 million years ago. These are the subspecies. First, we have the 10% stamina, 10% damage reduction, and 15% bone break, and 5% speed. And back to 10% stamina. This is the male skin and the female, which is exactly the same. We're gonna go through the calls right quick. Here is its broadcast. Dude, he's too sweet. <laughs> Here's our two call. Our threaten. Got to show off those chompers. Four call. I don't think there was any sound with that one. Top. And then our invite would just be the same as our two call. All right, and here is our baby model. We're gonna go through the calls right quick. Here's a broadcast. Basically the same two call. And our threaten. Four call. I've never seen a fish bow its head before. <laughs> Talk. Very brief. And then yes, the invite is the same. Here's the baby's movement a little bit. Or swim. All right, and here's the adults. Here's the swim. Down swim. And we're going up. Here's the sit animation and the sleep. Here's our get up animation. And we're going to take a look at the skins right quick. This is the default skin. Then we have Striped, Amazon, Grim, Atlantic, Apex, Aquarium, Barracuda, Titan, Dots, Stoplight, Melanistic, and Albino. Let's look at the abilities right quick. We have a regular bite that deals high damage, crushing bite, small damage, and moderate bone break, high stamina cost. Thick skull increases armor, so I'm assuming that's a passive ability. Reinforced teeth increases bone break damage. Yeah, another passive. Rending chomp. Charge up the attack and inflict armor rend for 20 seconds. Effectiveness based on how long it was held. So I'm assuming that's like a armor piercing sort of ability. Kind of like what they're going to give to Displetosaurus in the next update. For our senses, we have Fury. Taking damage increases outgoing damage by 3% for 7.5 seconds. Stacks up to 10 times. So if you get hit 10 times, would you have like 30% damage increase? Stubborn reduces the damage of the next hit by 45% has an eight second cooldown. If you're really good at timing, this will be the great sense for you to have. Front limb, we have strong pectoral fins, improves turning radius by 40%. And then we have refined jaw muscles, increases damage dealt by 11%. Bro, they are trying to beef you up. For metabolism, we have generalists can eat meat, fish, and shellfish. Hyper carnivore, only able to eat meat, food drains much slower. Fisher, able to eat fish and shellfish, fast food drain. And then sea food diet, S-E-E. -E. <laughs> able to eat fish, meat, and shellfish, decreases hunger depletion rate, increases maximum food amount, decreases max stamina and stamina recovery rate. I see food and I eat it. Ah, oh, they did it on purpose. That's good. That's good right there. And then for hide standard, we have resilient, increases bleed and venom resistance, streamlined, increases swimming speed and turning. And then we have armored plates, which increases your armor. For tail, we have ambush dash. A forward dash grants increased speed for 20 seconds after use can't be used in combat. So this is kind of like a getaway before you start fighting type thing. 
Then we have ramming speed, a short dash, and big bite increases inflicts moderate damage and bone break. Then we have paddle, which increases swim speed, and tail slap, which deals low damage. Okay, and so here are all the ability animations. First, we have bite. Very quick, very simple. Then we have crushing bite. Bigger bite. One more time, crushing bite. Then we have ambush dash. Then we have ramming speed. There we go. One more time, ramming speed. Next, we have rending chomp. The hole to charge it up. There you go. And lastly, we have tail slap. There you go. One more time, tail slap. And that's about it for Dunk Leos DS here. If you like this video, make sure to check out my other videos. I cover a lot of other mods. I also cover other animal games that you might be interested in. So definitely check that out. Again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.